Hi there everybody, it's UK independent Stamping Up demonstrator Halsey here from slimandstylish.stampingup.net. Thank you for joining me today for another five minute card project. Today I'm using the Celebration stamp set Beautifully Happy. This stamp set is free when you spend £90 or more with me from my store slimandstylish.stampingup.net any time before the end of February. So we're getting started today and I'm going to be using the larger stamp with the big flower on and I'm going to pop that towards the middle of the card on the left hand side. I'm using Memento ink because I'm going to be blending it in. Now this stamp set's great because it does have a double stamp so I could stamp the colour directly in um, which would make this even quicker than a five minute card. It would probably make it sort of a two or three minute card but I decided to blend because I like blending. <laughs> which has probably took it to our five minute card. So I'm going to be using, um, this is Parakeet Party, and I'm going to be using Sweet Sorbet and um, Dandy, uh, oh, Daffodil Delight. That's the one. I was going with Dandelion then. Um, Daffodil Delight for the centre of the flower. And I'm just popping this on quickly. Um, you can see I'm using the brush tip just to get as much colour on as possible. And I'm not really paying much attention attention to whether I'm going all the way out to the lines. I'm not going over them, but I'm not exactly going all the way out to the edge. I'm just popping colour onto the card. Um, you know, sometimes I spend quite a bit of time doing my blending because I do like playing around with the colours, but other times I just go quite quick and it's just to add like a real pop of vibrance on the card, and which is what I'm doing here. Um, I've popped a bit of the dark sweet sorbet on now and I'd missed a leaf so I went back and got it with a parakeet party and now I'm just going over with the light sweet sorbet um, and just colouring the entirety of the flowers in. So celebration started at the start of January. It's on until the 28th of February. This isn't the only set you can get. There's lots of other sets as well, and if you spend £45, you can get one of the other sets for free from my store. If you head over to my website and you go to the menu, it will say Celebration, and you can see there what you'd get for free. You can also ask me for a copy of the catalogue. Um, but this is one of the double stamp sets, so you get quite a few stamps in this, and that's why it's slightly more, and you need to spend £90 to get it. Once I had finished colouring it in, I decided I wanted some more colour in the background of my card. So I've used Pool Party and I'm just going to be sponging a whole heap of colour onto this. Now, it started off quite light and um, I added this on and just tried to build it up and I was happy with the soft colour. But you'll notice later, after I've put my sentiment and everything else on, I wished it was darker. So I go back in at the end and add more colour on. Um, because the blended colour is so bright, I'm not worrying about not going over that. Um, I figured the pool party wouldn't show on the uh, bright colours, which it didn't, so that was great. I'm using the double oval punch for the sentiment. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the sentiment out and hold it over the top to make sure it fits. And I'm just using this thank you here. So I'm just going to pop my block onto that use my memento ink to stamp that down and then I'm going to use the double oval punch. I'm going to punch both sections of this out because I want to use both on the card. I'm going to be using the white background with the white sentiment on top like this and as you can see after playing a little bit here that's when I realized I want more pool party. I want it to be a bit more vibrant in the background so I'm going to bring in my sponge and bring in my ink and go again and just keep adding more and more color. Before I do that, I'm going to adhere it to my card base. So this is just a standard card base, A5 piece of cardstock, scored in half to make an A6 card. And that's where I thought, yeah, more colour. You can keep building up the blending brushes. That's why they're great. You know, you can start off quite pastely and you can get it so they're really, really dark. You know, um, it's quite simple to move the colour around. So always a good option. As you can see, it's now really quite bright. So I'm going to use a um, bit of stamping foam. I've been using this quite a bit on my cards recently. Um, love it. And then I'm just going to be using some seal to stick the sentiment down flat on top. 
And there we go. A couple of embellishments to finish. So I'm just going to stick a couple of our jeweled rhinestones on there. And that is my five minute card for today. Hopefully you like it and you like this set. Please let me know below in the comments if you did. And I'll see you all again soon. Thanks ever so much for joining me. Enjoy creating. Bye everyone.